Hello viewers, today we will look at the limping dog. Marshall came into the family on December 2018. This is a video of when I went to see Marshall at Mission Possible in December. Although the video is short, can you observe that he does not seem to have any problem with his hind legs or his front legs? Great. Now, Marshall came home on 24th of December 2018. Yes, in a way, he is our secret Santa. All was well. He was settling in fine. He was following me like a shadow. He was eating. He was going out and doing his business. He was getting along with Blossom and my child. All of a sudden, when the winter really started, I noticed Marshall seriously limping along on his hind leg. Earlier, during his initial veterinary visit, his vet and my dear friend had noticed that he has been operated for an old injury, which was not told to us. We didn't have his history before. So that was left at itself. So come winter, when Marshall started limping, I suddenly wondered, why now? It was during this time that Parikshit and myself were having a bit of a tiff and the major of the household duties were left to me. So Parikshit would have his breakfast, go off to work and then the cooking and the washing and taking care of the children. Yes, Marshall is my child too. So I have three children. My human child, Blossom and Marshall. And so on and so forth. We are a family. The family has four wheels. The car cannot drive on three wheels and this is exactly what Marshall was displaying. He was making it obvious that hello you're a family unit you have to work together. By his limping the problem in the house became crystal clear. When Parikshit acknowledged this and started taking up a little more of the work. My anxiety reduced. The environment at home became more relaxed. And Marshall stopped limping. Yes, what do you think? Is this great or what? This is interspecies communication. And the best part was during this time frame, I had yet to learn about interspecies communication. It was only by observing my child, Marshall, that he is limping and I need to fix the limb. While this was going on in my mind, this issue at home was also happening concurrently. Once this got fixed, this got fixed. And in June, the next year, when I learned about interspecies communication, I said to Akshaya, Oh, Akshaya, that is why Marshall was limping. And she said, there you go. It must be. So this is how behavior among your pet, the environment at home, relates 
to one another has a direct correlation to one another your pets tell you in their own way that hey look hey wake up something's not right hey wake up isn't that wonderful give it some thought we'll be back with another story until then waiting for your comments like and share bye